the 2023 Miss America pageant. 51 women are set to compete in the nation's oldest women's competition. And representing Hawaii is Miss Hawaii, Lauren Teruya. She joins us this morning over Zoom from Connecticut. Good morning, Lauren. Thank you for joining us this morning. Aloha, thank you so much for having me. And you traveled all the way to Connecticut for this competition. It's got to be cold there, which is definitely not what we are used to. So how did you prepare for everything this week? I know it's jam-packed with activities. It is jam-packed. We pretty much run from 5 a.m. all the way to like 1 a.m. So we're running on low sleep. So that kind of keeps me warm. <laughs> Um, but we actually started this competition in New York City where we went around, we went to the NASDAQ, we got to go to incredible places, Grand Central Station, and just a lot of time bonding with these incredible women. As so far, do you have anything that's been your favorite? Um, has it just been that camaraderie with you know, your fellow um, sisters, I guess you could call them? Yes, it, I mean, it's truly a once in a lifetime opportunity to stand in a room with women from 50 states and including the District of Columbia, of course, and just to really share our stories and, and uplift one another, I think is a fabulous space to be in when you're surrounded by accomplished women who want to build you up as well. And of course, the big night is tomorrow. And as you just mentioned, you guys are kind of running on those extra fumes. You guys are <laughs> definitely doing a lot. So how are you preparing for tomorrow? Do you have any nerves? Are you feeling ready? Yes, I am so excited. I want to say a huge mahalo to our entire community. I've gotten so many encouraging messages and aloha through online, through phone calls. So I really appreciate our community. And yes, if you have the opportunity, the competition is on Thursday at 8 p.m. Eastern time. You can tune in on pageantslive.com and please um, root for me. I'll be feeling your love. And so, of course, 8 p.m. Eastern time would be 3 p.m. here in Hawaii. So as I know I'm done with my work day at that time, so I'll be able to <laughs> tune in. But some other people, they might have to take a little break. Take your lunch break during that time. Cheer Lauren on. But Lauren, <laughs> I know your sister was once in your shoes representing Hawaii at the Miss America pageant. Did she offer any words of wisdom as you, you know, left Hawaii to head to Connecticut? Yeah, I am so incredibly lucky that she's actually here with me. Five years ago, Catherine was Miss Hawaii competing in Atlantic City, um, and she was, you know, vying for the crown of Miss America. But the thing that she's really instilled in me is just being authentic to who I am. No one else can tell my story. No one else has sat in these shoes. So just being me, representing our incredible state, which is honestly my biggest honor, and to just be here, be present, uh, live in the the moment and shine bright. Some great words of wisdom there from your sister. And I know the arts is a thing that's very near and dear to your heart. And it's one of the things that you're really pushing for as your time as Miss Hawaii. So is it, or what are you doing for your talent competition? I'm guessing you're probably doing something related to the theater. If I remember correctly, Absolutely. you love doing that. Of course, yes. So I competed in talent on Monday with our preliminary competition. Should I make it to the top 11, I will then compete again. But I performed Cabaret, which is from the Broadway musical Cabaret. And the performance is actually inspired when I was 14 years old. Diamond Head Theater put on a production of Cabaret. And I wanted so badly to be in the production, but I got cast as the understudy. So since I was 14, I've fallen in love with the role of Sally Bowles. I've seen her you know, throughout my life. I honestly saw a, a woman of Asian descent playing her in the La Mirada Theater when I was living in Los Angeles. So it's a huge honor for me to stand on the stage, the Miss America stage as Sally Bowles performing my absolute dream role. That's so awesome. Thank you so much for sharing that story with us, Lauren. I'm sure that's very exciting for you to get to perform that on this big stage, because we could say an even bigger stage than, you know, what would have been when you were 14. So once again, good <laughs> luck tomorrow. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank you for having me. Aloha.